cocktails. We're going to try buzzball cocktails. I just read cocktails. Buzzball means nothing to me, but okay. I'm here for the cocktails. So let's let's do it. Yes or no? Is it alcoholic? Yes, guys. Today you're trying some alcoholic. Yay! <sighs> Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I am buzzing to try buzz balls. I've heard of them. I'm scared of them. <laughs> They're balls of buzz. Balls of buzz. <laughs> yeah. And like, what's the vibe? Like, what kind of night are you gonna have on a buzz ball? Are you, you gonna know have what? a chill it's, time? It's a strong. Are it's a strong cocktail. But I feel like no, no, no. Are you I feel get like arrested? we could definitely have two or three and be all right. It's like yogurt. Oh. Rum. What was it? Lotta Colada. Lotta Colada. Okay, this looks different to the one that I had. Maybe I had a different one. Mixed drink, a tropical pina colada cocktail made with premium rum, pineapple juice, coconut, and natural flavors. There's one goal of these, and it's just to get you get you hammered. Like there's 13 and a half percent in this tiny little thing. Yeah, it's novel. I'll give them that. Yeah. I haven't seen a shape quite like this. Very nice little alcohol grenade. Ooh. Yeah, it's so cute. I think it's so cute. I like it lots, lots, lots. Is this for me? It's for you. You can wanna, take it home. I want to keep this. You know that pineapples are like a sign of being a swinger. I thought it was like when you put your keys in a bowl. They're monkey. Now that's when you have a swinger party. Oh, okay. I'm very curious to see what it tastes I thought like. They, I thought they were like eight or nine percent. Wow, yeah. thirteen percent really throw me off now. I think the bar is low for canned cocktails. Oh my gosh! Cheers. What is this? Slanch. Slanch. Uh, I I hate pineapple. I really don't. <laughs> yeah, it's not pleasant. <laughs> what that made me do? Do you know? Oh, it's not bad. It's, it's not the rum that I don't like. It's the, the rum, the rum's nice. The pineapple is too rounded. It wasn't disgusting. It was like freaking you're buzzing. You're buzzing. That was the buzz, wasn't it? Okay, so I was expecting mm. it to be really, really sickly sweet, which is something that, especially canned cocktails, canned cocktails. I'm expecting it to be quite sickly, but actually, this isn't. Like that bad. It's like putting on suntan lotion while getting drunk. It's that kind exactly of exactly what it's like. Yeah. It's that awful coconut cream flavor as well. I like that they've done this novel idea with like a ball can. Mm. But if one was pre-drinking on the way to the event, you would look a bit strange cracking one of these on the bus. It's not the alcohol, it's the flavor of it's the other the flavor, stuff. yeah. yeah. I there's like a, rum. I love rum. There's actually not much alcohol taste off this, I don't think. No. So on the website, it says it's a proudly women-owned business. Oh. We yeah. love it. It's we already got a few to points in my it. estimation. You could knock that back. You could have a bandolier of them like, <laughs> at a party. Just take <laughs> them off. On your, on your Christmas tree. Yeah, you could put it on Christmas yeah. tree. Get yeah. a colada. Is that me? Yeah. Get caught in the rain. I'm getting buzz off your balls. <laughs> I feel like my good night of your life. <laughs> love this. Love the branding. I love like a retro love the vibe. style. It smells good. You can smell the spicy. Yeah. The chai. Oh, this one is giving me less luxury. Ah, uh, it's very neon though. Yeah, yeah. That's the, that's, I guess, part it's, of the problem. That will. Chili mango. I thought it said chill Jeez, mango. I didn't even read it. Uh, I thought it that's said That's so chill. exciting. It's chili mango. It's a spicy Ooh. margarita cocktail made with premium tequila, vodka, mango, and natural flavors. Oh my God, that sounds like it'll be great. Something about buzz balls, I really want to throw them. Like, they're just really, obviously I'm not going to. You could to, down the can but and I, then chuck it towards the bin. Yeah. Oh, that's delicious. Oh, hell yeah. Jesus. That's so good. A kick to that as yeah. well. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, girl. Ooh. I love it. Oh my God, it actually has a kick. That's it has amazing. such a good kick. There's a little kick in the back of the neck. Yeah. Mm. There's a little <sighs> chilli kick off it. Yeah. And usually, not my thing, not but I love, a go I love just a little... Especially in a drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You decanted these, you rimmed your glass with tahini and got like a little bit of a chili garnish. People would yes. be like, I need this recipe. That genuinely tastes so good. I really like that. You get these here. Is it more chili than mango? Mm. Mm. No, mm. I think the two of them were, they're really balanced. They're holding hands and running through a field together. One's not ahead of the other, you know? I think I don't need a husband anymore. <laughs> oh, sorry, everybody, take your rings back. No, <laughs> no, sorry, them. yeah. Give me no, the rings, no, I want the you rings. can leave. If you were making these for someone and you were having people over for like a summer evening, this would absolutely slap. I don't make anything like, for anybody, I just drink it ourselves. Well, <laughs> that can be done too. It's really good. Way better than the last one. Out of 10? Yes. Eight. Eight, yeah. yeah. I like this. 
This, this is, is nice. Great. Yeah. What is it? Strawberry Rita. I love the color. We love a cherry vibe. I haven't even. I like right. that the. I like it the can of see through. See through. See through, Pio. Ah, ah, this is, oh, this is nostalgic for me now. I really like the bottle, the, this, yeah, the packaging. Yeah. It's very, very nice. Not the same color though. No. I love the packaging. It's retro and simple and it just makes my eyes happy. Would you like to read the ingredients? This is very, I love this. This is very like Sabrina 90s vibes. A fruity margarita cocktail made with premium tequila, vodka and natural flavor. So it's just a margarita. Doesn't look like margarita. It smells a bit artificial. Yeah, it, it smells like a cool pop. Yeah. yeah. The gal oh. loves a margarita and we appreciate it. No, I don't think I've had a strawberry Rita before. I don't think I ha I've had a watermelon one and it was absolutely phenomenal. <laughs> With, with all of them, there's the initial hit of, there's something wrong, <laughs> right? Something's not right. Yeah. Wow. It's very good. Does an alcohol kick off that? Woo! Yeah, that tastes like <sighs> someone made an alcoholic cool pop. Mm. It's, that, it's that broad, dusty flavor at the start. It like, happens with all of them. It tastes like a cool pop. And I love cool pops. I prefer the spicy margarita. I prefer the spicy margarita too. It's giving- But I do like this a little bit less of a fresh strawberry margarita and more of like a preserved strawberry, but it doesn't taste bad. That would be delicious, slushified. Yes, it, it is so good, yeah. That is actually what, it's exactly the flavor, yeah. yeah. Like strawberry slushy, yeah. Mm. I, I love it, I think that it's a great marketing thing. Like I don't really care about the flavor. It tastes like a strawberry um, cool pop and I fucking, I love cool pops. I, mm. miss that. I just feel like this, the spicy margarita had more fun and more flavor. Totally. And like more, more of a vibe. <laughs> this Genuinely. is lovely. But this is very cooling and I, I like the yeah. spicy one better. I prefer the second one. I just like that kick of heat and I love mango flavored things, so. <laughs> <laughs> just, just getting aggressive. <laughs> Fuck you, drink. It feels like a dirty cola. Or if something, this is, is a Long Island iced tea, then I will be is that what's so impressed. Is? Look at the cool packaging. Oh no. You are oh. such a good barman, Colin. <laughs> oh, espresso martini? <laughs> Ooh, espresso martini! <laughs> sorry, sorry. A tempting cocktail made with premium rum, roasted coffee, and natural flavors. I'm, what do we think of this now? Cause I think this guy should, should not, he should be opaque. Mm. This is me fave. Oh, you can smell the coffee? You can, yeah. It's a bit beefy as well. That smells like stew. <laughs> Typically in espresso martini, you shake it and it has a little bit of like a head. She's not gonna be able to replicate that in this. Potentially no, you could fair. put this in tins, give it a shake and maybe you'll get some sort of head. It's I'm surprised you can get them here because they feel very holiday. They feel like I should only have them in Kusadasi. Smell that! It is! It's beef! It's beef! It's actually beef! It's just fun. <laughs> it's beef. It smells like gravy. Very exciting. Ooh! Cheers. It smells great. Oh, it's good. Wow! That's really good. That is actually really nice. Oh, that's a nice flavor, man. Okay. It smells worse than it tastes. Yeah. Sometimes you get them and they're really watery. Yeah. This is really nice. This is very nice. I would like an iced coffee. That's one of the better espresso martinis that I've had that are pre-prepared. That's the best pre-prepared espresso martini that I've ever had. I don't understand what I'm tasting. No. It's very sweet. It's very sweet. This would make me uh, be open to ordering an espresso martini with rum. I, I, Cause rum does give it that nice sweetness. And I've had one of those ones where they have the little gas thing inside it, mm. where they make it all foamy and that's just like, ugh. Not needed. You taste all that nitrogen. It's a bizarre, my, my nose is not matching up to my taste no. buds at all. It's really weird. Yeah. But espresso martinis, if you drink these on a night out and you're someone who gets affected by coffee, you may need an ambulance by the oh. end of the night. Because okay, you fair. will fully have heart palpitations. Like I've gone okay. on a night out and then I go home and I'm like, why? Why do I feel like I'm dying? But it's nice, man. It's nice. Again, the Christmas theme, the little bauble on the tree. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. saw mommy kissing Santa Claus because she had too many of these. Hey! This is the one I've had. Oh! Oh, I definitely read that wrong. Chalk tease. There we go. Fully clear. Ooh, it's just like you. It's a chalk tease. Get it. <laughs> 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 Why am I awkward? I'm like, eh. It's a delicious chocolate martini cocktail made with premium vodka, cream, and natural flavors. Divine. I love that. Yeah. Like Bailey's. Well, it's chocolate, so not, not even. Do you pour vodka into your Bailey's? Mm, I don't drink Bailey's because I'm an adult. I'm an adult. It's for children. <laughs> it comes out of a bowl. <laughs> 
Chocolate tea is coloured all right. Yeah. If it's a chocolate mm. martini, would this be like her kind of take on a white Russian, which I know isn't necessarily chocolatey, Ooh. but I feel like if it's cream and natural flavours, maybe this is going to give me white Russian energy, which is vodka, Kahlua and milk. Ooh. Ah. Oh, yeah. I want that. It's that sounds really, great. It's really good. So what are your views on the chalk teas? Are we on a game show? We're on a game show. Oh, lying. What? No you, no you, no you. Oh, this is really fun. It's really nice. It's Bailey's. Yeah. Yep. It's Bailey's. Amarula. It is yummy. It's so good. Oh, that's so good. Wow. How does it compare to the, the last day? I suppose the coffee one would be the most similar to it. No. No, no not, not at all. all. The coffee one, the beef baby coffee one. <laughs> <laughs> The beef baby. <laughs> Have you ever seen that baby? I smell like beef. I think this is the nicest one, is it? It's quite possibly the nicest one, yes. Yeah, no, that is definitely the what I've had before. And that is so nice. It really reminds me mm. of Bailey's. This is my favourite point yeah. so far. This is Christmas. This is pretty much what I had as I rang in the new year. And I do think it tastes like Bailey's, as in, you could fill me. You could fill me. He said you could fill me. I was you, like, could, you, could fill me. <laughs> you could fill me with this. These are all really, really, really good. Yeah, I she, would agree. She's done it all so well. She has. That was a real journey. Yeah, it was a good journey. We got though. to try a and lot a of different things. And a creamy ending. And who doesn't love a creamy Whoa, ending? No, no, that's not what I meant. No, you no, said no. what you said. Ah, sorry. You said what you said. Buzzed. <laughs> Buzzed. Uh, they're deadly. Well, except for the beef one. The beef one, I didn't like the first one either now. I love, 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 love the little cans. Don't know why they're all over on your side. Love them. Little, little balls. Play snooker with them? Yeah, so many things that you could do with mm. them. That was so fun. Yes, I agree. Love Great that. brand. Really love the, the brand. Love like her method. Love that it's woman owned. But mm -hmm. I wouldn't say no to it if somebody offered it to me. Honestly, yeah. Yeah. Who was given to me? We're buzzing for you to watch the video. And let me tell you this, you can catch us on Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays. Didn't know that? Why didn't you get a reminder? Click the, the subscribe button, ding the bell, get your buzz on. We're bleeding buzzing. Your buzz on. Thank you.